Hi everyone, Liz here. Thanks for stopping by. So exciting times. I've got a completion that I'm just going to quickly show you because I'm going to do a full kitting down and completion review on this one, but I just had to show you. And a new delivery. And these have all come to me from the good people at newcrafty.com. Uh, yeah, this was, now then let me look. This one I actually got last September. So you'll go and check out my new craft day playlist. Uh, you will see this one as a September unboxing if you want to see the full unboxing and uh, everything I got in that delivery. But isn't he magnificent? And yeah, I just had to show you him. It was only seven pounds and two pence and he's a 50 by 40. Uh, 13 different gems and colours and yeah let me show him I'll have to show him that way look so you can get the full effect just move out of the way Mr Parcel one second look at that he's absolutely glorious and my star sign is Leo the Lion so I will be putting him up I just love the fact that we've got the blues and the purples and the yellows and the greens rather than your, your standard lion colours and he's got a hot pink nose so he's a definite Liz <laughs> So I say I will completion review on this one. This was the one look that has fantastic gems, look those rings and the pearls. So yay! We'll get to put all those away because there are gem codes on the canvas as well. Yay! <laughs> Okay, obviously he's part of Smashing the Specials. We are coming to the end of January now. I will be uh, winding down a little bit on my specials, although I do love them, so I probably will carry on doing them. <laughs> okay, so let me pop him out the way, because he's the last time. And let's see what we got this time. There are special offers on at newcraftday.com at the moment. If you spend $45... You get 8% off and if you spend $59, you get free shipping. So if you spend $59, you'll get 8% off and free shipping. Yay! <laughs> I always like to check before I come on, uh, before I make my videos, so that if there's any special offers, I get to tell you about them as well. Because I'd hate you to miss out on your discounts, obviously, if you are watching this at a future date. Just double check what offers and things are available to you. Okay, so what did we get? We've got, oops, a little canvas. Oh, we've got a little eye poking out at us there. We've got, oh, 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 flowers. Hey, flowers again. Oh, Liz, what are you doing? And we have a packet. Oh, I think I know what that one is. And then one of my little extras. <laughs> right, so let's just have a quick look at the washi tape first. So yeah, there's uh, quite a bit on those rolls there and I just love this fact that they're sparkly and we've got a hot pink in there. So, I mean, you can use them on your craft projects. They're great for borders and things on cards if you do any paper crafting. Uh, you can use them around the borders on your canvases. You know, if you don't want to take the uh, writing off, you can put them on your canvases. Uh, the mainly, at, at the moment, I mainly use them for edging big canvases that I'm doing or full drill canvases. You don't tend to need them as such on uh, on a special drill canvas, but uh, yeah, very handy, very useful. So for the pack of 10, it was £6.97, which I think for glitter, and it's encapsulated glitter as well, not the glitter that comes off. So you're getting the glittery effect without, if you don't like glitter or you don't want glitter coming off. Oh. <laughs> It's alive. Glitter coming off on your projects. Then these are great. So yeah, let me just all right, let me just find an end. And these aren't as see-through as some of the washi tapes. You know, if you put it over something, some washi tapes are very, very uh, transparent and you can really see through them. But these tend to give it a little bit better coverage with them being uh, the glitter. And it adds to the sparkle of your projects. So yay liking those i say six pounds 97 for 10 so what's that uh, about 70 pence each which i think for a roll of sparkly washi tape is a good price just wrap those back up yay excellent so that's number one right what shall we look at next let's look at the package page can you see that shape there can you sort of guess what this is going to be i think you possibly can um do i need my scissors yes i need my scissors Grab my purple scissors, and we have da, 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 a 
set of placemats. Yay! So they are all crystal. Oh, I've got the little bit of paper again. <laughs> they do like sending me those. Uh, we've got pen, boat and wax. But these are just a little bit different and I thought, oh, I like these. So, oh, the stand's got a little bit bent. Hang on. It's got a little bit squished coming through the post. Oh, dear. It's uh, easily bent back into place. But I will let them know because obviously it's just got that little bit bent out of shape. But, uh, yeah, so we've got our stand to put them on. Yeah, it's just, I think, it's as it's uh, come through the post, they've just because that's a weaker point there to pressure to put pressure on it's just got a little bit flattened but okay we can bend that back into shape and i'll just put a little bit of black marker or something on there oh, yeah and um, there are lots of different ones coming out at the moment as you know i have done one one set of placemats already or you could use these as large coasters it is a set of four but when i saw these i thought i've just got to have them they're just so pretty the price of these is £12.51 and we have all of them. I mean, they're all pink. What can I say? Pinks with sunflowers. So there's that one and then that one that's a little bit different shape. They're just a little bit more interesting. I mean, actually, if you're somebody that uses one of those really big mugs, then these would be brilliant as a coaster as well or as a side plate you know if you've got your normal big dinner plates these are quite nice for putting your side plates or your glasses on your table or whatever so yeah or again you could put them on your wall but these will definitely get used They're very pretty in fact actually i can think of somebody that is going to really really like these as a present so yeah and then that's that one and then that one's more of the yellowy orangey one uh, with the pinks in the background so a set of four placemats i do like them um it does say uh, eco-friendly on the description as well so whether that means they're um reconstituted wood or something uh, recycled wood or something like that not sure but uh, yeah that's what it says but i just thought they were so pretty i just had to have them uh, again i did do the experiment of putting plates on these once i've got these done i will do that experiment again putting plates and bowls and cups and things on them to see how well they stand up um, I will be putting cork backings on them as well. So you just get that little bit of extra protection if you are putting hot things on them. Um, one lady has said to me that her daughter is into resin and she actually covers placemats with resin. So you get a completely flat surface and a very, very durable plas plat flat surface. <laughs> Get those worms right, Liz. <laughs> okay. But yeah, aren't they pretty? I just, uh, yeah, had to have them. They're just so gorgeous. I say lots of different placemats coming out at the moment. Um, and I am loving them all because they're so useful. You know, you've got a craft that you can enjoy doing. And it's not like having your pictures and things, which I love my pictures. But it also means, means that then that uh, you've got something that's useful afterwards and practical. So if you're gifting it to somebody, it's not just something for them to put on the wall it's something that they can actually use as well which is a brilliant idea that's why i've loved diamond painting over the last few years because uh, yeah there is just so much um coming out so all the new stuff loving it so yeah go and check out newcraftday.com's uh, website to see all the other ones that they have so let's give them a quick measure so we're about six inches which is 15 ish centimeters um we'll do this one it looks a little bit bigger this one's about nearly six and three quarter inches about 17 ish centimeters and then by about so they're six inches 50 so yeah they're all roughly round about the six seven inch mark by the 15 17 centimeter mark so a nice size yeah i mean it on the face of it it doesn't look big enough to put a plate on but if you are putting a plate on then it does work as i said i did show that on a previous video right look at all these sparkly gems and colors let's have a look at these so we oh, hot pink <laughs> we have 18 different colored crystals wow so we're starting off with a sort of a nearly hot pink this is the color that it looks hot pink in the camera but actually it's a little bit paler than a hot pink 
and then oh look at that a very very deep dark red and a pale pink and a little bit of a hot pink there and a pinky red and a hot pink oh there's going to be lots of hot pink in this because i think there's another one at the end as well and then a lime green and a grassy green and a dark green and a lovely sea blue and a gorgeous orange and an orangey red and a very bright amber colour there and a little bit of your bronzy colour there and a pale pink and a honey gold and a pale lime green and a hot pink to finish with so it's got three hot pinks in this it was a definitely must have i've got to have the hot pink <laughs> so that's all of the placemats and the lovely crystals with all that hot pink and i say pen but wax can't remember whether i said that or not but anyway i was so excited to look at the flowers i possibly forgot about the toolkit <laughs> So pop those into the little stand. It does still work. It's still fine. As I say, it's just got a little bit squished in the post, but uh, yeah, not a problem. Okay. I will let them know about that though, obviously. We'll need to know for the packaging and things. <gasps> right. What shall we look at next? Oh, let's look at this one. This is uh, again, one of the new collections of special drills. I am still on smashing the special. Maybe February when you see this one, I'm not quite sure. Um, yeah, I got it uh, last week. It did take about only about 10 days to arrive. So really, really good shipping. Uh, and yeah, because I had that horrible dreaded bug cold thing, then uh, yeah, I lost my voice. So I'm a little bit behind with things. But anyway, let's get into this one and have a look. So the price of this one was a four pounds and forty-three pence. <gasps> Hot pink hearts! Oh my goodness! Wow! Pen boat wax. Yeah, I won't forget this time. I don't remember this. <laughs> Look at those! Look at those in a minute. And this one is look. Oh, look at that! Yay! It's a little gong gnome. He's got a little gift. And he's got all hearts and roses. So he's like a, a Valentine's, isn't he, really? One of my favourite flowers is uh, roses. I've got a special plate in my heart, place in my heart for roses. Because uh, my granddad um, did used to grow roses in his garden. He mainly grew carnations. He was uh, a big member of the Carnation Society. Um, but yeah, he loved roses as well. And he did grow some very, very beautiful roses. So yay. I thought, oh, I'll have to have the rose, the one with the roses and the pink gnome. Yay. Oh, look at that. His little hands. You don't very often see the hands, actually. Um, or is it just me? Have I seen hands before? I don't know. I don't remember. I think they're usually like in gloves and things, aren't they? Maybe that's just because I've been doing a lot of Christmassy ones. But this one will go on my Valentine's display. And I've only got a couple of weeks to get it up. Well, I haven't really. I've got about a week to get it up. So I will be getting this one done sooner rather than later. Because I don't want to do my little Valentine's display. And I really want it up for at least a week. So I really need to be getting it uh, done and ready but yeah isn't that cute so what we've got one two three four five six seven eight nine ten different gems and colors there's no codes uh, unfortunately on the canvas and there's no codes on the packets but we'll let it off because i can see some hot pink hearts <laughs> uh, let's give you a quick measure i think we'll find it's a 25 by 30 by 25 by 25 yeah 25 centimeters nine and three quarter inch square so it will fit wonderfully in my little magnetic frames so yeah i'm gradually changing them out and um, most of the well i think there's one christmasy ish one it's snowman so i thought well snowman can stay up because it's january february i was hoping it would bring us some snow uh, other parts of the country have had snow we didn't get any we just got lots of rain and wet so go figure <laughs> Ooh, i have still got my cough so i keep having to pause and have a bit of a cough and i'll try and edit them all out because you don't want to listen to me coughing <laughs> or maybe you do i don't know anyway so oh look at that really lovely glare crystals and a little bit of a pale pink 
And oh, a few teeny tiny. I mean, like your pale goldy colour there. And a hot pink, yay. And your standard 310 black there. And some nice bright red. And a limey green. And then we've got silver hearts and hot pink hearts and flowers. Oh my goodness, look at those. Wow, so there are they. Oh no, they're all dotted round. I was thinking they were going to go on his hat. So see, yeah, so the flowers are all on his hat in between the standard crystals. And then the specials, the pink and the uh, silver hearts, are going to be dotted all the way around the canvas. Oh, that is great. Love it. He's got a really big smile on his face look as well. You can tell underneath that moustache and beard is a great big smile. And he's saying, just for you. Oh, excellent. Love that. Absolutely. Oh, love it. And I love the crystals even more. <laughs> oh, no. Let me fold it back in the packet. Looks like I can see the hot pink hearts. Excellent. Okay. We're definitely... Uh, some nice bright pink flowers and then we've got our lovely little gonk gnome there and some sparkly crystal washi tip. Yeah, you've got some great guns here. This one's a little bit more muted colours, a little bit more countryside. But uh, yeah, this will go up to spring after I've uh, done my Valentine's display. In fact, this one could actually go up now because these are some of the colours that I've actually got up now in my little corner. I think you just got a sneak peek there of what it is. So yeah, a little bit more muted, although lots of sparkle and ABs there. Okay. And we have pen, boat and wax, your standard little toolkit. And this one is like a little cameo with a little hedgehog in the middle. Again, there was quite a few um, in like this set. I think there were squirrels and little bunny rabbits and all sorts in these. And it's just so cute. Look, it's just saying, hello, just popping in. And I've just got my nice little flowers growing there. But yeah, it's like a little oval cameo style frame there, isn't it? And these gorgeous lemony yellow flowers going all around the edges. Oh, and this one has got crystal coats on it as well. So yeah, and uh, sorry, I keep banging on about this, but I'm just so excited that I've discovered this. Go on, tell me everybody's known about this for years and it's just me that's only just caught on. I know, late to the party as usual. <laughs> So let's do this one a quick flat and down. Oh, flattening a hedgehog, that's not very good, is it? <laughs> Close your ears, hedgehog. I'm flattening you in a good way so that you uh, stay nice and um, flat. No, that's even worse. <laughs> his little feet at the front there as well but there's quite a lot of gems on this because you're going all the way around the frame twice there you've got all the ornate decoration on the frame and then all the flowers so it's very very pretty oh that's just so cute i always want to cuddle hedgehogs but it's probably not a really good thing to do because they are very very prickly uh, this one is eight different gems and colours. And again, this price, this was the same as the Little Gold Gnome, which is £4.43. Okay, so we've got like a pale, very pale bronzy. We've got like a very pale bronzy colour. Get it in shot, Liz. It's no point in telling people what colour you've got and then not showing them. Tell you, what am I like? And then we've got a lovely, very clear crystal. And a pale gold there, and a pale sort of lemony gold, and a lovely bright green for the leaves. It's going to be a nice contrast with those those golds and that green, just to bring out some colour in it. And then, oh, some little semi spheres in the full gold there, and then some little teeny tiny marquees in gold, and then some silver marquees with an iridescent coating on, which I'm not showing you again, am I? I'm too busy looking at it myself rather than showing the camera. Oh dear Liz, am I out of practice because I've missed a few days filming? I don't know. So where do the little round gold ones go? Oh, they're going to be dotted around in the middle of the flowers. I think that we've got them. Oh, there, look, and there. So they're all the centres of the flowers. Uh, the oh, look, the little um, gold, the little gold marquees are going to be all the little prickles on the hedgehog. 
oh that's cute and then these will be the flowers yep so there are the flowers on oh, i think it is a little girl she looks like a little girl doesn't she? she's got a very little soft face so i think she's a, she only looks like a baby as well oh so cute that little nose and very bright eyes so they've left the nose and the eyes as just like the painting so you're not putting any gems on those so you're getting the more sort of realistic feel of those and they're nice and bright and do wet you know we've got sparkle in the eyes there as well so very very pretty oh lovely Huge thank you at newcraftday.com for sending me these. Uh, yeah, we've got our gorgeous uh, sparkly washi tin. Ten pack, lasts you a long time. And then we've got gorgeous. our placemats, which can't wait to get done because they're going to be really sparkly as well. Hot pink. And then our little Valentine's gnome, which I must get done so you can go on my Valentine's display. And then our gorgeous little baby hedgehog there in its little cameo. Looking very, very cute and sweet there. Oh, we've just got a little bit of a more muted cut, a more muted palette, just to tone things down if you're not very keen on the sparkly hot pink. <laughs> and of course, we started off with our beautiful lion. So do go and check out newcraftday.com and the website and have a look at those special offers. Okay, well, if you've enjoyed looking at these with me, as always, a hey, thumbs up is very much appreciated. Any comments or questions in the comments down below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. And if you want to join our little family and see what we get up to next, then if you press that subscribe button down in this corner and the all notifications bell that pops up, you'll be notified when any of my videos come up. So you're not going to miss anything. Yay! Okay, thanks ever so much for stopping by. And I do hope to see you all again soon. Bye for now.